Uh, you know, I said what I said on Saturday about I think he's a great player, right? Um, obviously, I get a call from Coach, you know, and he doesn't have to do shit like that. Like, I respect it. Um, but, I mean, after that, it's like, what can I really think about other than he's coming in and he's a part of our team now. So, um, I, like I said, bro, I got a lot of respect for bro. Like, so, it's one of the things, you know, we all going to come in and grind. So. You said you get a call from Coach. Do you, do you worry about your role with the team or today? He talked about how you laid it out for everybody. You know, do you worry about that, though? Uh, I don't worry about it, really. If I'm being honest, at this point, right? But I can't worry about that, in all honesty, because then if I'm, if I'm worrying about that, I'm out here on the field, and I'm not getting better. And so, like, the main thing is about getting better. Yeah, that's really the only thing that matters. So, from from my perspective, I'm helping the team get better and getting better along the way. Probably would have asked to not talk today if this happened last year. And that's where, like, me being a grown-up now, like, growing up, and y'all tough, man. Y'all don't, y'all don't, y'all don't take it light. You know what I'm saying? Y'all are a strong New York media group. So, um, I feel like I'm at a place where, you know, like, we can speak on things like, and be honest, so. Um, I feel like that's a, that's a big difference. How do you feel about the talent of this running back room as a whole now that you add Dalvin Cook to it? Yeah, that's nuts. I can't believe I'm in a room like this. It's cool, though, because, you know, like, however things play out, like, you can't really control that. You know, I was told by, you know, Coach, that, you know, like, this doesn't change anything for me, but it might. You know, like, we, don't, don't nobody, like, got the perfect formula to this deal, so, um, that's what I'm saying. That's why I say all I can do is grind, right? And so, and let the chips fall where they may. So, um, but the room that we have right now, it's nice. Like, I, I don't know. You can't even get this done on Madden. It's great, man. Having having my dog back out there, he deserves it. Um, he's a great player. And honestly, like, forget player. He's he deserves this moment. You know, to be back on the field. And he's grinded hard ever since. Uh, you know, he got hurt. I remember we had a talk when he we was in the locker room in Denver. He just, you know, I took my my PCL when I was in high school, like LCL, like it felt the world over for a minute. And it's not because your knee hurt; it's because you just want to play football, and you know that your season over. And so, um, you know, just looking back to that moment, it feels like it was just yesterday, and now he's already back. You know what I'm saying? So it's a testament to how hard he's worked and um, how Nicolini and you know the surgeons and all those guys like have you know got him back right ready to play. So. Um, he didn't really do too much today, but he had fun, I'm sure. So it's me versus me at this point. Like, I was already competing to try to be the best. So I don't think, like, my mindset changes on anything. Like, like don't get it twisted. Like, he's a great player, and I'm always giving him his flowers. Like, you know, I'm from Florida, too, so it's cool. But um, at the end of the day, like, and this is, like, these are things that, like, they would say, too. Like, the other guys in the room would say, too. Like, you can't really worry about other stuff too much. You gotta just focus on you.